Elbow arthroscopy is a keyhole surgery for the elbow joint and like all arthroscopies may have two functions. On occasion it's what's called a diagnostic arthroscopy which essentially means looking into the joint to see what's going on. This is less common these days as we have good modalities of investigation of the elbow prior to surgery, not just clinical examination and x-rays, but quite commonly MRI and MRI arthrogram. However, on occasions, it may be necessary to have a look inside the elbow joint to see what the problem is. The second form of elbow joint arthroscopy is what's called a therapeutic arthroscopy, and this means that surgical procedures are carried out via the telescope, such as removal of damaged parts of the joint, removal of loose bodies, which are pieces of bone which form inside the joint, and this is quite common uh, in the elbow, and sometimes removal of bony spurs, which form part of arthritis. In terms of the practicalities of the operation, it's generally performed under general anaesthetic on a day case basis, and the patient afterwards usually mobilises fairly quickly with just a padded bandage on the limb for the first 48 hours. Like all operations, it does have some complications, and these are essentially that of infection, which although uncommon and generally treated by some antibiotics, may on occasion require the joint to be washed out again. And there is a small risk of damage to nerves and vessels, although this is usually temporary, will usually result in some numbness for a short period of time. Thank you.